Right guys, it's me. Uh, this is just a quick video. I'm going to have a bit of a moan. <laughs> um, as you can see, I'm building the uh, Bronco 6x6 Buffalo. With um, It's got the digger and everything on, which I've built. Um, and the, but it's also it's the slatted armor version. Um, there's the digger part that I've built. Fully working. It all works. It's uh, you know everything. Everything's going great. I've built the side slat armor. Slat armor for the sides, which was a nightmare, but I got through it. And I've painted it now. I'm in, the, I'm in the final throes of the kit, I would say. Well, let's just get that because this is what I want to have a moan about. Oh, I'll just drop that on the floor now, which isn't good. Hang on. A lot of hanging ons on this window. I'm unprepared. So, that is supposed to be the finished article. Correct? Right? Alright, yeah, good. All good. So far. Anyway, my issue is, is with the instructions. I mean, as you can see on here, it's all about building the slatted armour there, you know, and here. Building the front sections. To place on then the next part here goes about the back the back door sections and everything on there you turn the next page and it's how to put the back doors on and then you move on to the crane but hang on a second if you look here where the front part is there's some strengthening bars you see them better on this part here yeah, but and I've looked through the whole book and I've looked through the instructions. They've just magically appeared. So technically, Bronco have missed a whole section out, and there's the win there's the window section, but there's no instructions on where to put the strengthening bars. So now I'm kind of like, oh. It tells you all about the strengthening bars for the side pieces. It tells you there. But there is nothing in these instructions on how to put on the front window strengthening bars. So I just thought I'd point that out. I mean, it's it's doable, but I'm just going to wait now until the very end to see what I've got left so that I know what pieces to use. But it's still a bit of a... Uh, especially with the price you pay for these uh, Bronco kits because they're not cheap you know you'd think uh, you know unless of course it's there to test us because building these were supposed to be skilled model makers but I still think it's a bit of a faux pas or whatever on Bronco but apart from that it's an excellent kit so I'm going to stop moaning and I'm going to pull the big boy pants up and uh, and battle on, but I just thought it might, it was worth making a video and having a bit of a moan about it. So anyway, that's it for me. Nice quick video. Right, I'll catch you later, guys. Bye.